What's up besties? This is Dina with Styling Curves. Okay, so I wanted to bring you guys a really quick try on haul from the dressing room. Um, I haven't done one of these in quite a while and I feel like Ross is really bringing it right now. They have some great items for summer and while some of the things that you see in this video won't be at the Ross by you because it's like random sometimes how the items show up, I still wanted to show you some of the things that I found and give you ideas on how I styled them really quick. This video is going to be super short because the air conditioning in the Ross that I went to was not working so I literally was overheating in the dress room so I really just tried on the outfits like boom 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 super quick but go ahead and join me and see if you like anything I hope you enjoy it All right, so item number one was this amazing floral romper in black with pops of red and green. I thought it was absolutely amazing. It was the softest cotton ever, and it had a tie on the side. The V-neck was really pretty, just a little too low cut for my liking. I would pin it or put something underneath it, but it hugged the curves really nicely, even in the back, and it didn't have any show through. I actually bent and tried to see if I could, you know, kind of stretch the fabric to see if you could see my undergarments, and they didn't show through. This was a great find at just $10. Yes, you heard me right, $10. I think it would be a great versatile piece for summer. All right, so on to the next item. I found this so cute. Okay, first it's a it's actually two items. It's a crop top. The Coca-Cola is a crop top. Then I found this houndstooth check pencil skirt with an accenting red stripe up the side. So what better to pair it with than this Coca-Cola crop top. Now the Coca-Cola crop top was pretty big. Um, so I tied it in the back and just kind of played with it, but I really think the two looked cute together. I love Coca-Cola and I love their, you know, their trademarking and everything. And I just thought it looked cute together. You could either wear the shirt open, um, you know, loose at the bottom or not, but I chose to play around with it, let it loose, tie it up, kind of see, and it looked cute just about any way I wore it. I also took that same pencil skirt and I went ahead and paired it with this blessed tank that tied at the bottom. I also thought it was really cute. Um, it would be cute with a pair of jeans, but just too cute to pass up. I think this romper was one of my absolute favorites. My gosh, just staying in the black and white theme. And yeah, I didn't shave my legs because I didn't know I was going to the store. So sorry about that. But isn't this adorable? Look at the checks in this. I love the tie at the top. You can either wear it off shoulder or on the shoulders. And it has a little elastic at the waist. I think it would look really cute with the belt, but I do like that it had the elastic built in. This was probably one of my favorite pieces. I don't know, there were so many cute pieces, but this one was fantastic for sure. The next one is also a shorts romper, and this one also caught my eye. Again, you can wear it on your shoulders, off your shoulders, but I love the colors in this floral print, and I love the little pom-pom type um, piping that edged out the shorts and the top. Super, super cute. Yes, you know I came home with this one. I couldn't resist. It was adorable, and it's so soft and comfortable. The cotton was just so soft. Again, like $10. I mean, who could pass that up? The next one was this amazing formal pants outfit. Now, it's like a one-piece romper. It appears to be two pieces, but it really isn't. It is actually one piece. It's so sad the video does not do this thing justice. It was gorgeous in person. In fact, I just wanted to buy it so I'd have somewhere to wear it because it was that cute. Sorry, I'm not so great with the camera here. But um, it had these amazing sequins on the top. Oh yeah, it just sparkled like you wouldn't believe and it was pants and it was super stretchy on the bottom. It fit like a glove and it just felt 
amazing. If you're looking for something to wear for a special occasion, now is the time to go scrape up some deals. This was only $20 because it's off season for this type of item. Okay, the next one was this really soft summer type dress, super flowy, with this kind of like feathery leaf neon print. It kind of reminded me of a LuLaRoe item. It was that kind of soft fabric. It kind of had the flair of the dresses they have. I think um, their dress is called the Emile or something like that, that style. This would be really cute, worn just like this, loose for summer, or pair it with a coordinating colored belt for a really cute look. This also was super inexpensive. Then there was this cute little blessed top that was just cotton with the little coordinating white stripes on the cuffs and it tied at the bottom. And then I found these little white capris and they had the little um, studs going down the side in silver, which I thought was really cute. And I thought, well, this is a cute little comfortable outfit to go hang out in or, you know, if you're doing work around the house or whatever. I just thought it was cute. Go to school in, you know. Okay, so I told you it was going to be a super quick video, and it was, right? I hope that you guys saw something that interests you or something that might work for you for summer. I'd love to hear which outfit was your favorite, so drop me a comment below and let me know which outfit was your favorite or which one you'd love to find at a Ross by you. Also, if this is your first time to my channel, thank you so much for joining me and watching. If you enjoyed it, please hit that subscribe button and turn your notifications on so you can know when I come out with another video. And for all my regular besties, I love you, I love you, and I appreciate all the support that you give me always. If you have any requests, please drop those below the video as well and I'll try to put a video out for you. Until next time, this is Dina with Styling Curves. I'll see you all real soon.